day six. Day six with COVID? Or maybe I don't have it anymore. I don't know. I should probably take a test. So we're going to be making ramen noodles, but we don't have any ramen noodles. We don't have instant ramen noodles. So that's my problem. It's because like I want instant ramen noodles, but I don't want to go out and I don't want to order any food. So we're going to just make it. Um, we're just going to cook it with what we have. Um, so we're going to improvise. All right. So we got some leftover steak. We got some noodles. We got some... What's it called? We have a leftover spice pack. So let's utilize this, shall we? It might look like I'm wearing the same thing as yesterday. Well, that's because I am. We don't have instant ramen noodles, but we have this packet. And we have this Percatelli. Servine, Severino homemade pasta. Thick bucatini. We have some holes. I will say, like, everything is kind of crazy right now. Like, I don't have a lot of stuff organized as it should be, but it's kind of messy, but we're leaving on trip soon, so I'm just going to start cooking up everything in here. I don't want to fall asleep. My life is on repeat. I just cook all day and I sleep barely. So while waiting for the pasta water to boil over there, we got these noodles, leftover steak, pepper jack cheese, a little cute little broccoli guy, a little broccoli boy. So we got a tray, I'm just gonna put stuff on the side. This is uh, called mise en place. So I'm so I did a video on how to cut bell peppers, every single way to cut a bell pepper. Cardi? This steak here is cold. I'm just gonna go ahead and slice into it. Yeah. Uh, right, we have some water boiling here. Um, it's boiling. Pretty hot. Hot water. Don't test hot water like that. We're gonna throw the pasta. Get it cooking. Right here, I'm gonna step out of the shop real quick. Spicy. Oh, anyway, oh, everything red. My whole face hurts. Everything burns. How are you holding up there, champ? Just finish this block of bar. <laughs> you're just eating cheese at this point. You're just eating cheese. She's just eating cheese. It's not even eating it. Um. Anyways, that's day six. I feel better. Baby sleeping. So we're just hanging out, eating lunch, and um. Yeah, that's about it. Probably get to start cleaning today. I feel better, so I'm gonna start cleaning up. We're gonna and then desanitize and break everything down, get everything ready for next week. It's 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 crazy how much like lighting makes a difference of everything. 
like I wish I had as much lighting everywhere because I can drop the ISO, pick up more detail in a lot of the videos I make. But it's whatever. Um, just been filming a lot of these food vlogs lately because I don't know if I want to put out there a lot, but like a lot of the food I make for my short videos, I don't like plan anything out. It's just what we have in the house and what I'm cooking. I don't like to go too much into like detail about what I'm making or write recipes all the time because I don't really have the time to make recipes. Like as a chef, you just cook, you throw things together, and that's how it is. But you know, like I said, I'm feeling a little better now, so I'm gonna start cleaning up, getting reorganized, and ready for the week. Because uh, hopefully we can get back to work and start doing things. Maybe if these videos do well, if you guys are interested in these kind of things, then I can like just show more vlog things of me going up to cooking things and then including it in the video. And if you do want recipes, I'll just do a little thing where like I won't actually make a recipe video. It'll be like, hey, do you like that vid that recipe I made in that video? Um, then let me know and then I'll make a recipe and I'll tag it on my website. But you know. I'm still figuring this thing out, so thank you guys for joining this journey. It's been really fun lately, but um, last week was kind of stressful with not being able to work. So we're going to be behind a little bit, but hopefully um, I'm able to figure that out this week. But uh, yeah, next week's going to be pretty exciting, so stay tuned on that adventure. I'll be vlogging about it as well. But we're going to take a cross-country trip on a train with the baby. So that's going to be exciting. But until then, I'll let you guys know how it goes. Thanks for tuning in. Much love. My face is freaking on fire. Uh, I'll catch you on the next one. Stay happy, stay hungry. Feed your soul and feed your mind. Until then. Mm.